What's up YouTube family? Hope you guys are having a great Monday. <clears throat> I am on my lunch break about to run up to um, UPS and ship out uh, the boxes um, that I had put together for my two uh, giveaway winners. And um, so I wanted to share um, a dream that I had with you guys last night. Um, I thought it was pretty insane that, um, so today I had text, um, because me and, uh, Saved by Grace and Lily Girl are in a group chat together and we talk all the time, but I had texted them this morning and told them, um, about the dream that I had and all of a sudden, <laughs> Saved by Grace, um, Christina comes back. She literally had a, uh, had a dream. Um, it was just crazy. I'm gonna, I mean, I'm not gonna talk on her behalf or tell her about her or tell you guys about her dream. I'm sure that later she's gonna upload, um, the dream that she had. But it was just crazy that I, I had this and then she had that and then we started conversing, uh, about it, conversating about it. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and share with you guys, um, what happened. So I was driving down the road and all of a sudden I'm driving and I just had like complete pure like panic and fear because all of this destruction um, just started happening and I thought that the rapture was happening <clears throat> but I wasn't sure because I didn't hear the trumpets go off I didn't hear um, the trumpets sounding and so I'm freaking out because there's panic and everything going on. There's destruction happening. And so immediately, um, well, no, before I get on the phone, I, I look up as I'm driving in the sky and I see like these white spirit type things um, floating up in the air and, or not up in the air, they're kind of, they look like they're just all over the place. Like they're, and then they're like diving down. And, um, I, I called so immediately um, I called Flora I called um, Lily girl and I'm on the phone with her and I was so happy that um, that she picked up the phone because um, I knew that the rapture didn't happen I was just I was it made me feel better to hear her voice and I'm yelling and I'm like Flora you know like what's going on what are these because I like I had an understanding that she was seeing them too and I said Flora what are these and I remember her telling me that they were souls that were going to hell and I just thought that was wild so um, at that time as I had called her on the phone that's I had pulled into this gas station <clears throat> and and then I guess I pulled back out on the road and I'm driving with somebody I don't know who's driving um, I so we were going down the road and we were driving down this road um, along the beach um, kind of reminded me of the little island that I'm from but um, I'm driving down this road and there's houses on each side like you would see on an island like on the beach and I'm driving and this tsunami is coming <clears throat> I knew the tsunami had hit um, and as I was driving down this road I'm looking and the water is just completely just starting to flood um, the road in front of me and I'm yelling at the whoever's driving and I'm like stop like turn around we can't we can't go through this um the, the roads it's starting to com just completely just be just flooded with water from the tsunami that had just hit and i'm yelling at the person to turn around and the person that is driving they're like are you sure and i'm like i'm like yeah i'm sure like we I, we can't go through that and i just complete panic and and destruction was happening and so we turned the car around and then I remember seeing um, these, <clears throat> they were, they weren't like the, the spirits that I had seen. I saw, um, so after that I had seen um, rockets or uh, like missiles or um, bombs or something, um, or missiles like flying up into the air. And um, I had, then I had an understanding. So after all this said and done, um, after I woke up and earlier I had an understanding that what Flora saw were the um, were the souls that were going uh, to hell 
um, that had died from those rockets or those missiles hitting. And so I think what I was seeing um, was that I was seeing the, the destruction and the panic um, and I was seeing the tribulation. Um, and and I, now I have an understanding of what I saw was and this is just I feel like um, as soon as the rapture happens, like as soon as the rapture happens, it's going to be complete panic and complete chaos and destruction uh, destruction will come. Um, so I knew that the that the rapture did not happen yet. I knew it was basically it was any second, and I just I know that what <clears throat> he was trying to tell me is that the um, that the rapture is very soon, and right after right after the rapture happens, um, destruction is going to come, um, and then. Um, and then I did see, I saw the souls that were going to hell um, that were dying from all of the destruction and Flora had told me. And that's that's what they were that I was seeing or that she was seeing and that we were seeing um, people, the souls that were going to hell from you know being blown up by the missiles and stuff. Because the second time I had seen what I saw in the air, I knew that they were, um, that they had something to do with each other, if that makes any sense. <clears throat> um... Christina had just a chilling dream um, of uh, a tsunami hitting and then another one happening. And so I'm going to um, let her come on and uh, tell you guys about that. But uh, man, he is coming. And I just know that, I, like I feel like and I know what he was trying to say is that the rapture is so soon and that basically like as soon as it happens it's just going to go like downhill from there. So, um I wanted to share that with you guys. Um <clears throat> I don't care what people think um because way before I have ever been on YouTube or ever thought about creating a YouTube channel, um I have dreams from the Lord and I've had them since I was a kid. And I know when they are from him because of the very first one that I ever had. And God says, uh, the Bible says that um, that in the end times or in the end days that people will dream dreams. They will prophesy. They will um, they will see things. They will have visions. And that's what he's doing. He's, he's showing us things that are soon to come. So people can mock and scoff all they want, but it is what it is. Um, and so when I get something, um, I will, I, I have to share with you guys because I want you guys to know what I'm getting. Um, all I can tell you guys is it's going to be really, really bad. Um, when we are out of here, um, and that's why I don't think, I, I really don't think that people are understanding the true importance of saving helps help saving as many souls as we can because when the rapture happens like that's it there's going to be people that are going to be left behind and right now we have the opportunity to help those people not be in that situation because and I don't even think people are fully grasping how bad the tribulation is going to be how bad the destruction is going to be um, I don't think people even have a clue I don't know if people even think about it or even read Revelation but it's going to be worse than any movie producer could ever even think up. Um, any, it's going to be worse than anything that anyone has ever seen on this earth. Um, so I, I urge you guys to rise up, step out in faith, get uncomfortable, um, share the gospel. And this was on my heart yesterday and I was going to tell you guys this, but I forgot. Um, when you're planting seeds, there are going to be many people where you plant the seed and they may not come to faith right away. But the reason why it is so important to plant the seed because there's going to be a lot of people that you've planted that seed and you've told them about the rapture. You've told them about God. You've told them everything that's going to happen. You've tried to tell them, uh, you know, to bring them to faith. You've tried to tell them about Christ, but they didn't want to listen. There are going to be many, many, many people that are going to, that are going to come to faith after the rapture and they're going to be saved they're going to go through hell on earth 
but they're gonna there's gonna be a lot of people that are gonna be saved and a lot of those people may be because of you because you planted that seed so it's up to God um, it's you know what I'm saying like it's it's up it's up to God you know all we can do is plant the seed and he's gonna come along and there may be people that come along and water it but um, God saves so um, you just plant the seed and you just leave it in his hands um, and and that's all we can do so I wanted to share that with you guys I know that destruction is coming I know the rapture is coming so so soon um, I can't wait for you guys to hear Christina's um, dream because it gives me like literal chills so um, I just wanted to share that with you guys and uh, I'm gonna run and ship these packages out um, hope you guys have a great rest of the day and I'll talk to you later